Welcome back to another episode of Denning's Legacy. Uh, Cat Denning's is just currently asleep at the moment, but Dyer's obviously up and playing with a dollhouse. Alright. Oh, yeah, and I'm sat here watching it because the bleeding pub's been shut down, but nobody's got arrested, and there's not much to bleeding do, especially with all the rain and all that lot. And what you might be doing on this game now? Well, I'm bringing Dyer up, the toddler. Right, so, this game is an education game for people who have children then, is it? Because that's what I'm seeing now. Well, you do have to look after their basic needs. You have to teach them to talk, to use the potty. So, it's, it's a, technically the psychology, or it, it, it's a, um, one of them... Well, it's a sandbox game. Sandbox game? What? 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 Sandbox? You've got a sandbox for your yanning, yeah, all right. Well, yeah, I've got a pool thing, but no, a sandbox. Oh, I was trying to think of the word, you know, when you're, like, flying a plane. And the, 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 oh, the, a simulator. The, the simulator. So this is a simulator for children. Well, yeah, it's a live children. simulator. Who the hell invented something weird like that for? Well, do you want me to explain the sandbox game first? And I don't like... even know what, I was just thinking of a sandbox, aren't I? I mean, I've got no else to do now well, it, to watch you on this because you've got to play at least once a week, you say. Yeah, because you get the TV six days a week. But, and again, the, um, this term sandbox alludes to a child sandbox so the child can create and destroy with no given objective. Um, it's like one of the first open world games, is Sims. Right. That's why it's so popular. I don't get it, but I'm right. So, you know, you're playing pitch. Well, it's interchangeable. So you haven't got like um, stuck to a certain plot like you when you're playing FIFA. You've just got to keep kicking the ball around until you win well, the you game. Well, you're not criticising my game. I'm criticising you, your game. You're always criticising my game. I think game. when I criticise your game. I mean, this is teaching people to be parents now, isn't it? Oh, you are. Oh, well, you ain't in a no way, ideas. but obviously it's um, much harder in real life. Oh, but... do you? I hope you realise that. Don't think you can press buttons on a kid and think you can just control it. Well, no, there. but obviously somebody's... I mean, you're not doing a bad job. Look, the poor little son's going around topless all the time. Why are you can't address her and all that lot? Because she's that busy. She's still trying to keep oh, a record you're busy. deal. Oh yeah. Yeah, but I'm teaching her how to support her. I'm teaching her how to talk, and and if she's warm enough, if she's cold, I'd know. Oh right. It tells got you. Got sense of century because all the money you got. Yeah. For me, garbage and all that. Oh, oh no, not from that no, no, from my music vi um label. Oh right, yeah, your music. I'm still have to keep oh, up yeah. with that because they still text me every day saying we've got to produce another track. So I've got to get up there in the attic and create. Oh, you're moaning using the attic. Uh, well, it wasn't that long ago. You were using the library, was it? Hey, well done. You finally said the real word, using, not abusing. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Right, Knew it. Well, you're abusing your own arm, then. Stick with that, then. So as you mentioning Cat Dennings when she were homeless anyway. She hasn't been homeless you're for a while now. You're not that, you said. Well, if you, to me, the homeless challenge is like um, a homeless challenge. So you can't start this game like you're doing now, it's just sleeping around, well, sleeping in your bed. Well, it's like um, it's like um, a big thank you to the creator of Sims in a way. The homeless challenge. I think this is why it's so popular because the guy will write. Um, he first designed it to be a virtual dollhouse. But then it suddenly changed um, when his house was in a big firestorm in 1991 and he had to replace all his possessions, he had to rebuild the house and he just got this idea of, wait a minute, why don't I do a game where you've got to do everything in your life from scratch and rebuild it and do like a sandbox game that way. Um, but unfortunately he was knocked back a few times um, because Maxis couldn't really get past thinking about people wanting to play like proper lives so they got interested in his first one which was like sim city but then ea got on board and they really liked the idea of this and they could see it as a, a really good franchise and that's fortunately what happened it became a really good franchise but the point is that 
game designer thought about this and changed it to this kind of Sims game from the city one because his house was destroyed. So it's like a big thank you to the designer for feeling like he was homeless and coming up with the idea of Sims when he was homeless. So that's why I wanted to start my first challenge off in this 26 generations with the homeless challenge because it was like a big thank you to, to, to Mr. Wright because thank you for designing this and creating it and keep pushing for it even though Maxis knocked it back um, a few times but obviously when a year came on they could see the potential luckily and they bought out Maxis so so he lived in a shed and all that lot next to a volcano on there no he didn't do that but the whole point of me being next to the volcano was because he did lose his house in a firestorm all right so oh you've been a bit technical what you've been doing once a week then yeah i've been thinking about it i mean i didn't just randomly go in and why pick you keep talking to yourself and all that though. it's just weird what do you mean talking to myself you talking yeah, because I'm recording it and then putting it on YouTube. Oh, you better not be recording me. I've been recording you for months now. Since when? See, that's is how much you, you listen to me. That. I mean, I'm sick of, I don't know the game, do I? But I've, but I've told you I was putting this on the internet. This is what I've been saying. Nobody wants well, to. What, what, what do you think I was talking about when I said that the people don't want to hear about the neighbours? But our neighbours, it's quite interesting that guy with his all oil wheel and his wheelbarrow and his shed with his legal Christmas Well, it's not interesting. It's not interesting now because he's been. Wow, 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 Let's see about it. What? You should be saying you've been recording me. I don't know that I've been leaning out the window looking at the neighbour and all that. Especially when the neighbours um, uh, knickers on the line and all yeah, that. Yeah, they heard it all. What do you mean they all heard it all? Who? Everybody who's watched my channel. Watched your channel? I thought you were doing it on the Sims game, not for Bleeding Real. I told you I'd put it on YouTube. Yeah, I thought you meant on the Bleeding Game. Not bloody real life. So then what? Well, what do you mean YouTube is? is? Yes, I've been hearing you. I wonder I thought you were going mental playing this game, talking to your son and all that lot. Where did you think, who do you think I were talking to? So you Sims characters thinking they're bleeding real? Is that, what, is that why you've been shouting at the TV? Because I told you they can't eat. They're not real. What do you mean they're not real? I mean, you're playing a virtuality simulator and uh, being a single mum now, aren't you? Yeah, but that weren't my choice. What? Husband cheated. Oh, 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 it's not my, 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 my plan was to be a right, family. Right, uh, uh, Well, she's got a funny thing status, right? She classes she's a single mum. For how come she has different fellas? You know the woman when I went down fast up, she was telling me she's uh, a few fellas going around there house and that. Yeah, but that's just But is her status class as a single mum? When she meets a new fella, does that status go away? Well, no, if she's, she's not, if she's not in a if she's not in a serious relationship, then he's not going to be committed to her, and he's not going to be committed to the child. Because it takes a big man to take on a child what's not theirs. Going up. What are you doing there on this guy? I've been. I'm going out. She's been stuck what, in the what? house for two years. Oh, you've been stuck in the house for two years? You have not. You went out last Tuesday shopping. No, not me, the sim. What, all right, yeah, all right. You, you character you keep talking to. Yeah, Cat Dennings. Yeah, what? So you're going out, what? What are, you, what are you going out for? Well, it's the Harvest Festival and she just wants to go out. She was going stir crazy, so. So, I'll gather you got some in mind in the kid. Yeah, I've got a nanny. Yeah, I thought, I thought, well, I wasn't paying attention then, but, yeah, I thought I missed that. So, what are you going to be up to? Just more eating and, and stuff and that? Well, at the moment, she's talking to this guy, Corey, and getting to know him. Oh, bleeding that What? Well, the guy with the red hair. Yeah, why are you talking to a bloke? You've got a status of being a single mum, aren't you? Well, it's not what I wanted, is it? I wanted a family. You wanted a family? Yeah, you got yeah. a family. you got a kid, don't you? Yeah. Right. So well, what are you talking to another fella for? Well, why not? Are you saying because I'm a single mum I'm not allowed no, to? No, you lose your single mum status if you meet another fella. You can't be classed as a single mum then. I'm only I'm talking you... to him. It's not like I'm going out with him or anything, oh, I yeah? I know what you be reacting in your bitch. Oh, I might as well then. Tell you what. I'm whoa, going... whoa, 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 I'm whoa, going... Whoa, Fine, I'm, I'm going to 
to exchange numbers with him and flirt. <laughs> no, no, don't do that. No, he's no. taking my number now. No, you're going to get accused a of it. With your, your character. Why would I have a bad reputation? I've got a great reputation according to oh, the game. Oh, you know. Well, what's it say then? It says that I've got a good reputation. A reputation of... Good what? reputation. A good reputation at what, though? What do you mean at what? Well, you... Just being a nice person. I'm not, yeah. I'm not, like, oh, look, you little whippersnapper. Oh, on her arm. Where's the paper set? Oh, there you are. Right. Well, I'm back now. All oh, right. So... So I'm cleaning up after the, the um, harvest fest because you get like these gnomes up coming in your house. You have to give them gifts, but what it, even the if the hell is don't get if, that. And if you give them something that they like, they have a halo above the red. But if you give them something they don't like, then they get this oh, flame. Oh, that neighbour was playing that. Why did he have gold plated gnomes? Didn't know there were gnomes in this. Well, that was the one what was growing some illegal and illegal. ended up what, Christmas trees. Yeah, it wasn't Christmas trees. They look like weird Christmas trees, like baubles and tinsel. Uh, yeah, because it's um, Maramawana or whatever the heck they call Maramawana. it. Maramawana? Oh, they wacky backy wacky stuff. Yeah. Oh, that's oh little dead, right. I wonder what people are lacking up me strange on the street, you know, what I've said about legal Christmas trees. Oh, I kept telling you. Oh, I'm watching you doing the virtual world. I'll go out in the real world. Well, what do? Well, I...